Now at 631 to that breaking news, deputies say shots were fired at them during a chase. Yeah, they also say that it came to an end after the suspect here involved in that chase ended up on 249 and Antoine Drive in Northwest Harris County. Let's get right to Courtney Fisher. She's live for us this morning. So Courtney, this was a wild and dangerous chase. It sounds like at one point. Yeah, yeah, Rita. At one point, deputies say they were going more than 100 miles per hour trying to keep up with this guy. And they say during the chase, while he was driving, he fired at them three times. Listen to part of this chase. Any injuries? Negative. You still south on 249 the way ahead of me. Going 100, probably 110. 36. Shots are fired down here, sir. And so the chase ended here on 249 at the Antoine intersection. You see in the video people being treated on scene. That's because investigators say the driver crashed into an SUV hitting innocent people in all of this. None of those people, though, were seriously hurt. So good news there. There were several people at a nearby Whataburger who saw and heard the crash. Some of them ran to help. Yeah, but we didn't know why the siren was on. We just knew it was a wreck. We yeah. didn't know that they that they were already chasing him because they came so quick. Yeah. Oh, okay. Like the helicopter was already up uh, on top. Yeah, you heard her say the helicopter was already up on top. That's because this guy ran from his car after it crashed. So police took the helicopter out. Deputies had canines out here, and it was actually the dogs that tracked him. He was hiding in a storm drain. That man has been arrested. As for why he didn't stop when deputies initially tried to pull him over on Jones Road, about eight miles or so northwest of where the chase ended, well, they say they're still trying to figure that out. For now, reporting live, Courtney Fisher, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.